Ah, uh, Megamind. Easily one of the most worshipped films of the last couple of years, its release in 2010 has hardly stopped it from being a mainstay in digital culture in the far distant future of 2022. From Metro Man farting, to Titan's glow up, to the thousands of references people make to the big blue guy and his excellent sense of style, this film remains a worldwide classic. However, the image of Megamind asking no bitches is simply a prolific interpretation of older memes, which thrived online in longer structures such as Welvender Great's 2015 smash hit, Who Don't Got No Bitches. This would eventually be shortened down to You Get or You Have No Bitches, which would eventually be condensed to the simple No Bitches we see today with Megamind. The original frame seems to be taken from the point in the film where he puts his face up to a peephole on Roxanne's doorframe, introducing a fisheye lens effect which become popular in meme culture years later. That being said, it's difficult to pin down exactly who was the first to utilise these particular frames in digital art spaces, as they've remained a popular mainstay for years. This would be evolved to the familiar No Bitches format in late 2021, first appearing thanks to a user whose name I won't pronounce, although it feels as if the image has been taken from somewhere else considering its poor quality reeks of repost-induced generation loss. The thing is, anyone using this meme knows it's entirely toothless and immature, and that's exactly where its beauty comes from. It feels so pathetic as an insult that it's almost just an extremely gentle ribbing, which means it can be swapped between friends or enemies with ease. Telling someone they don't have a partner is one of the oldest insults in the book, and this appears to be a modern iteration using classic slang in order to ironically provoke some sort of response. Whether that response is generated by the phrase as a question or a statement doesn't matter, as the stupidity of it all just works so well. This is conveyed by the fact that one might observe different edits paying homage to Megamind's looming forehead and wide eyes, as well as an avid appreciation for the scene in which he begins to appear properly vulnerable and admit his mistakes in the film. At any rate, it's clear Megamind has a definitive hold on internet culture years after its initial release, likely due to the fact that it's a genuinely good film and that it switches the hero and villain dynamic in a fantastic manner. Essentially, the Megamind No Bitches meme does a great job of creating an insult so immature and stupid that it becomes brilliant, ensuring the film consistently retains its place at the forefront of online discourse. What meme would you guys like me to give a lesson in next? Let me know in the comments below. And remember, like and subscribe! <laughs>